All right, so this is a 2009 iMac, and it is my mother's, and it's gotten to the point now where it's 5400 speed hard drive is very slow and takes forever to boot up, shut down. Took two days literally to install the new iOS update or the OS update uh, from Apple. So uh, we are going to replace it. And to replace it, we're going to go with uh, the new M1 Mac Mini. We're going to pair it with a Dell, should be a 24 inch monitor, 1080p, because she's elderly and doesn't need a 4K monitor. And then because Apple does not do anything with RGB or any kind of cool lighting, we uh, got some speakers that have some coolness factor. Uh, we did already replace the keyboard and the mouse. These are brand new um, as of around October. Um, so we don't need to buy those, so that was lucky. Uh, all we need to do is get the mini, uh, the speakers, and the monitor. So let's see what this looks like. Have our legendary knife here. And uh, let's give it a little slice. Let's see what this is all about. Because these new M1 chips are supposed to be pretty kicking. always does a very nice job of packaging. Alright, so it looks like we have a uh, black cable for power. That's nice. And that's about it. speakers. Now on the old one, uh, there were built-in speakers, so we didn't have that sort of a problem, but um, now with the new Mac Mini uh, and no speakers on the monitor, we had to invest into some fairly inexpensive speakers. Uh, so that she can listen to videos and Maybe she might have to while she's computing. Get out of the box. Alright, so these are driven by um, USB and a simple jack. So that's not too bad. We have plenty of those on the back of the Mac. Wrap it, I guess, to see where they all are. All right, let me get that Dell uh, monitor unboxed, and I'll be right back. Okay, we are back. Uh, Dell monitors are really easy to uh, set up. Uh, the stand, it's a two part stand, um, just to screw it together. Um, and then slide it in and it clips in very nicely. So that was pretty easy. We have it plugged in and we have an HDMI going out into the Apple here. Uh, we have our speakers ready to go. Um, they just plug into the back down here. Uh, 
there's only two USBs on the back, so speakers are definitely taking up a precious slot. Um, and then we have our mouse and keyboard. So let's um, see if we can get this started up. I'm going to plug her in down here and see if she'll fire. See what happens. Now the power switch is right here on the back. Oh, it's alive. See what it does. I did, I did. Pair up already. Alright, the mouse is working, that's a good sign. Just wait for the keyboard to be recognized. Alright, there we go. Select your country. There we go, United States. That's nice. Alright. Let me put in the password real quick. speakers. Oh, see, look at that. Oh, these speakers are cute. Alrighty, once I get this set up and running, I'll be right back. Alright, we are back up and fully running. Look at this. So, this is a really cool background and all, but can't stay like that. The computer has to exactly match the old one. So, luckily I found that dog picture. <laughs> And we need to find that and make that our background or my mom will be very, very upset. And she probably wouldn't even accept the computer until I put it on there. So let's... Alright, come on. What was this mess? Let's plug that one in there and then I'll plug my USB in here. here and temporarily put that there um, I think I should probably make a folder and put it in um, documents nah just put it in documents all right so there it is 
It's in documents. Now let's see how we can get that to be our screensaver, or not screensaver, but our background picture. We have a folder for desktop pictures. That would be cool. Wow, let's check that one out. Wow, that's pretty cool. See, she could never handle any of these. It's got to be her doggy picture. right so if we didn't have that she would literally just make me turn the computer off until it <laughs> had it back on so I need to set up her email and all of her other things but uh, yeah that's it the speakers uh, look uh, are pretty good now obviously due to uh, YouTube we're not allowed to uh, play any music or anything cool, right? So, but you can imagine. Play a little Rush Live here. I'll turn off these um, bright lights. So you can see the, the colors on the speakers. Not bad for under a thousand dollars. Not bad at all. Yep, so this will last her many years to come. So there you go, we'll wrap it up. Thanks for watching. Alrighty, this is a little bit of a after video tip. Um, once you get your new Mac set up, uh, make sure you check for updates and this brand new uh, Mac mini had 19 gigs and it's updating uh, right now so you definitely want to go check that out and um, since Apple does not support RGB lighting in any way we uh, have added our own here so we have some added pieces of flare I don't know how many pieces of flare your computer has, but Apple does not seem to like lighting, so we have to add our own lighting. And we have this really cool little remote. I don't know if you can see it in the dark. I'll turn the light on. So we have this little remote. And we can change the pattern on the lights. So now we have flare. We have four pieces of flare with our fantastic new Mac Mini. So this is my first 2021 computer build of the year and hopefully we'll have some more. So thank you all for watching.